Jake Paul just bought a massive mansion in Puerto Rico. Watch until the end for all details. The YouTube turned pro boxer is living it up and has made a fortune. He recently bought a $16 million house in Puerto Rico. The mansion is 12,800 square feet with eight bedrooms, 12 bathrooms, a six car garage, a big pool, and a guest house. He even said he's going to add a koi pond to the waterfront walkway and make other additions to the house. He has a six car garage for a reason. After all, the boxer has a pretty nice car collection worth millions alone. Of his flashy whips, Jake has a Lamborghini Huracan, a Rolls Royce Phantom, a Tesla Model X, and a Ferrari. Jake's Lambo is a bright blue and costed him $300,000. He had to wait six months to get his hands on one, but I'm pretty sure it was worth the wait. He posted that it was his dream car, so you can only imagine his emotions once he was able to get behind the wheel. Jake also has customized his Tesla at West Coast Custom to have red and black stripes and carbon fiber accents. That is sure to stand out from all the other regular Teslas. His most expensive whip gotta be the white Rolls Royce worth $350,000. Beyond his lavish cars, he also had to get a whip to go off-roading with. He bought a Toyota Tacoma in white that was around $50,000. We all know Jake is adventurous and likes to have fun, so this is just the car for that. He also has another truck, a Dodge Ram, but not just any Dodge Ram. Jake made sure he got the Black Ops model. He likes to stand out because his other car, the Ford Focus was custom wrapped by West Coast Customs once again with a colorful camo design. Jake even named the car Rainbow because of it. Jake Paul has made a lot of money through his endeavors in his early days on YouTube as well. Over the years, he has made a huge fan base with millions of subscribers and followers. Lots of his videos would be based in pranks of all sorts and doing different types of daring activities. After his stint in YouTube as a creator and influencer, Jake decided to make an unexpected switch over to take on a professional career in boxing. He has put a lot of commitment into this new career of his. Those boxing matches have allowed him to make a lot of money as well. With the money he has made, Jake has been able to buy a few lavish things besides just cars. He has a whole watch collection with some watches including Richard Milley worth $500,000 and a Jacob & Co. Turbion worth $450,000. We've talked about cars, but he also has enough money to travel in other ways. For one, he has traveled in a private jet multiple times. Of those times was after he beat Tyrone Woodley and then flew in a Dassault Falcon 900 tri-jet. Now that's the way to pull up and leave the scene. This man clearly likes nice things and puts his money to good use. With his new house located out the country, I'm sure he makes use out of other frequent private jet excursions. Jake definitely be taking crazy trips out the country and has lots of company over at his new house as well. The house parties probably go crazy. He has to be living quite the life on that tropical location. You've got the crib, the beach, and all the vibes. I would bet that many would probably have Jake's house listed on their vision board. Just look at it. With the many ventures Jake has dipped into, he has accumulated and stacked lots of money. And it's because he has built such a great platform for himself, he can live pretty free. Jake posted a whole new video showing off the crib and walking through the property with all the rooms and features. Must be nice. He said the backyard is his favorite part of the house with the scenic view and all the right vibes. There's a batting cage, man cave, a music studio, giant movie theater, and more. What else could you possibly want? With the in-house studio, can we expect a song drop from Jake soon? One thing we do know is Jake knows how to flex. Beyond the crazy crib, Jake once showed off his insane diamond chain that was worth $225,000. The ice has his nickname, The Problem Child, engraved on it with a spinning star on the top. 95 carats of diamond and 14 carats of gold, weighing a total of one pound. If that big chain wasn't enough, he also spent $100,000 on a chain of Conor McGregor knocked out. Now that is just different. It's clear Jake has money written all over him. 
The guy has definitely been getting to the bag in the boxing ring. After all, Jake and his brother Logan relocated to Puerto Rico a few years ago for the main purpose of intensive boxing training. Going to a tropical environment is one way to lock in. That's a different level. Jake and Logan have more than one crib though. They bought Miami penthouses for $21 million each. They signed contracts for units at the 11 residencies Beyond Tower in downtown Miami. The property features three bedroom and three and a half bathroom units and also includes common spaces, a club, spa, and gym. Each penthouse comes with an outdoor kitchen and a plunge pool. It's an entire 65-story, 461-unit building and has had other celebrity buyers in the past, including WNBA player Candace Parker and MMA fighter Luke Rockhold. These units start in the mid $300,000 range, so it's for the best of the best. After all, the private amenities are available only to residents in the tower. They include a helipad, a resort-like sun lounge deck with 93-foot pool, a state-of-the-art fitness center, and fully staffed executive office suites. Before owning luxury property in different cities, Jake also lived in Los Angeles at the Team 10 house. That Calabasas mansion was described as a personal playground for himself and his friends to create content for YouTube and social media. It was all fun and games until he decided to sell the house in 2020. He said he wanted to focus on his career as a professional boxer and needed no outside distractions, so went ahead and sold his $7 million house. He originally bought the house for $6.9 million. The house is 15,000 square feet with 8 bedrooms and 10 bathrooms. Beyond the master bedroom, the house has 7 other suites, a gym, a theater, and more. There is also a pool with two waterfalls, grills, and several patios. The garage even fits four cars, and the motor court can fit 12 more. He originally made a YouTube video of that house too, giving a tour of the mansion to all his fans. The fans have been waiting for Jake to drop YouTube videos again, and he sure came back with a bang with his new house tour. Jake Paul has more than 20 million subscribers and followers on YouTube and Instagram. The comments showed lots of love, with a lot of them saying how inspiring Jake's journey has been. Jake and his brother started off making fun YouTube videos, and now they're buying million dollar houses, building companies, and having fights. Jake said he's going to be back on the video wave, posting every week with different content from his everyday life to training videos. We'll have to tap in to see what he's up to next.